Hello my friends, I hope you're having a lovely day, and in today's video we're doing something a little different because I have something I want to talk about. It's not really something I need to turn into a huge feature, uh, but it's been gnawing at me, and I need to address it in some way, so I'm going to talk about it today. Um, I want to talk about the reviews for Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles Remastered Edition. I have not played the game, so I don't know uh, anything about how poorly it plays online or any of that. I know the reviews haven't been too favorable when it comes to online, and that's fine. I need to play for myself and see how it is. But there is a topic that I haven't seen covered in a lot of reviews, and it absolutely blows my mind. I don't understand how so many outlets cannot talk about the music in Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles Remastered Edition. Now, I want to say right off the bat that I'm not going to name outlets in particular because this is not meant to shame outlets and I'm not knocking the work that they do. Everybody works hard. Everybody does great stuff. Um, I just am surprised that this uh, aspect of the game is not covered in, a, 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 I want to say, a majority of the reviews. I haven't read every review on the internet, obviously, but... I've gone through, uh, let's say, the bigger sites out there, and uh, I read 10 reviews, and of those 10, uh, 5 did not mention music in any way, shape, or form. One of them mentioned that the music has been given a uh, the remastered treatment, um, but didn't say anything about the music other than that. And then the others actually talked a bit about the music. So, <laughs> I mean, let's look at it this way. If you're doing a game review, video games, more often than not, have music. Shouldn't there be at least a few lines in there about the game's soundtrack? Maybe the mood it sets, or what you think of it, or uh, just the kind of vibe that it gives, or maybe the, the style of music that's in there, anything. I mean, when games are reviewed, we talk about the graphics and the gameplay and multiplayer and all that stuff, but music is very much a part. I think any game should have some mention of music when it comes to the review. You, uh, that's, a, that's an aspect to review. So, uh, yes, in general, reviews should cover music, but the fact that there are so many reviews out there that don't even discuss the music of Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles at all is so surprising to me. Now, obviously, music is subjective. You could say um, the music in any game sucks or the music in any game is great. Um, I just think it's a shame that music is not covered in any way in a majority of these reviews. But, personally, I believe the soundtrack of Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles to be one of the best gaming soundtracks that there has been. Its soundtrack is so phenomenal and really sets the tone for the adventure and is really pretty unique even to this day for video games. It's got a certain sound to it that you just don't hear very often. I, I, I'm, I'm trying to think of any other games that have really uh, touched upon what Crystal Chronicles does with its music and nothing coming to mind. There's a couple games that use like similar instruments but not the overall tone and approach. It's just an unbelievable soundtrack. Uh, Polygon's Brian Gilbert, uh, this was a while ago, did a video feature talking about why he thinks Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles has the best Final Fantasy soundtrack. Brian, I know you have this opinion, but keep it to yourself, because it's a bad one, and everyone's going to hate you. Look, man, I'm supposed to be the devil in this situation, and even I agree that, like, this isn't even an ethical thing. It's just a, it's just a bad business. Okay, see. Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles has the best music of any Final Fantasy game. Please don't hate me. Let me convince you. And I know that's, you know, uh, hyperbole and all that, but it, it does draw attention to the fact that the soundtrack in this game is phenomenal and worthy of discussion. <laughs> and that's why I'm so irked to see that reviews skipped over it. In my personal pantheon of game soundtracks, there are soundtracks that I continue to listen to to this day, even though they are for games that came out uh, many, many years ago. I was going to say millions, but that's that's overdoing it a little bit. So, uh, Symphony of the Night soundtrack, I still listen to that to this day. A lot of the Mega Man soundtracks I still listen to. Uh, there's, there's a handful of them, but Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles is 100% in that mix. Uh, back in the day, I put that soundtrack on my, uh, I guess it was just a regular iPod back in the day. And I used to listen to that on the way to college. And uh, uh, it was like the only thing I listened to for months and months. I just could not get enough. 
It was such like a great relaxing way to start my day as I was driving into college. And ever since then, I've listened to the soundtrack. Um, I, I stream it uh, at least once a month. Uh, maybe not the whole thing in its entirety, but uh, a vast majority of songs. There are so many songs in that soundtrack that are just uh, amazing. They are so fantastic. I can't say enough good things about them. And that's why, on a separate note, it's killing me that Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles Remastered Edition seems to have been screwed up by Square Enix when it comes to uh, multiplayer, which is, you know, the heart of the game. And online play here has so, so many uh, hurdles that you have to jump through before or jump over before you can uh, play the game online. And even then, it's a bit of a hassle. So, uh, I was looking forward to this re-release as a way for people to experience the game, because I do love the game very much, but even more so to experience the soundtrack, because it's just unbelievable. I mean, I could gush about it forever. So every tra forever. Every track in there is just... Oh, man. Just thinking about it right now is giving me goosebumps. It's that phenomenal. But... Unfortunately, Remastered Edition doesn't seem like it had uh, too much care put into it when it comes to <laughs> core aspects of the game. So I don't know that people are going to experience this soundtrack within the game. Hopefully, they will experience it uh, outside of the game, but uh, not a lot of reviews are talking about it. Again, I can't stress this enough. I am not doing this video to crap all over other outlets or their reviews. They have their way that they handle reviews, uh, and as I said, they, they do a fantastic job. They're getting important opinions out there. I really appreciate that. Uh, so I'm not trying to make those people feel bad. I'm just very, very surprised that uh, audio, or specifically the soundtrack, is not mentioned. And as I said, I think game reviews should cover the music in some way. Uh, even if these reviews said uh, that they hated this music and explained why, while personally I would be like, how could you hate this amazing soundtrack? I would be happy that they paid attention to the soundtrack, because I feel every game deserves that uh, when, you, when it comes to a review. Uh, but unfortunately, that's not the case here. So, if you're getting anything from this long-winded video that was supposed to be short, Listen to the game soundtrack. I don't care if you listen to it streaming on YouTube or some other platform. I don't care if you listen to it while you're playing the game. Whatever you have to do, even if you are not interested in this game, listen to its soundtrack. I really do not think you will, you'll regret it. It's something that has stuck with me for so long and it is fantastic, separate from the memories I have of the game. It's just really phenomenal stuff. One of the best examples of a video game soundtrack out there. All right, my friends, that's today's video. Thanks for watching, liking, subscribing, and commenting. It's very much appreciated. Also, a huge thank you to all you who support me on Patreon. Uh, helps me do videos like this, helps out with the site, the podcast, social media, all that good stuff. So if you want to learn more about the Patreon, which is just a dollar, you can check out a link in the description below. But that is it for today. I'll be back tomorrow as long as I got something interesting to show you. So until then, have a lovely day and a lovely evening, and I'll see you in a few short hours.